Alice Wong, PC, MP, is an educator, entrepreneur, and active community leader who immigrated to Canada from Hong Kong in 1980. Currently, she is a member of parliament for Richmond, British Columbia, and Minister of State for seniors. Before being elected to parliament, Alice Wong taught English as a second language and entrepreneurship at Vancouver Community College. She also worked hard assisting her husband with his family business. She continued her studies at the University of British Columbia and obtained her PhD in curriculum and instruction in 1993. Alice Wong joined Guantelan University College, now Guantelan Polytechnic University, in 1998 and became the manager of international programs until 2006. She started the Center for Small Business at Vancouver Community College, which offered the first bilingual small business management classes for immigrants. Since its inception, the program has produced many successful and award-winning entrepreneurs. Please welcome our Minister. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, for your kind words. And good morning, everybody. I'm really honored to be here with all of you to celebrate Canada's first official National Senior Day. Advises the federal government 
on matters related to the interests of Canada's seniors. We also know that when it comes to well-being, involvement in the community is important. That's why we are investing additional funds into the new Horizons of Seniors program, helping more than 100,000 seniors use their leadership abilities, energy, and skills to benefit their communities. I would also like to acknowledge some of the other measures our government has undertaken for seniors in recent years. This includes increase to the Guaranteed Income Supplement for Canada's most vulnerable seniors, providing $2.3 billion annually in addition, additional tax relief to seniors and pensioners, and providing over $70 million, I should say $70 billion this year for Canada's public pension system. Now, we all appreciate a little recognition and acknowledgement from time to time, and seniors are no exception. So, together, let's show our appreciation of Canadian seniors. Thank you very much.